Introduction We all know we have only one life to live. That too is very short to learn everything. We live it the way we want. And life is not a bed of roses. Exactly these words were told by my grandpa when I was 8 years old. Our success and failure depend upon the choices we make in our lives. The results tell us how well we lived our life. Every life has its own story to tell. Every event is giving us the experience to share. Straight from life is about learning from our own tutor. In our life, we always need a teacher who guides us how to lead a life. And our coaching started from the day one we came into this world. Our first teacher is our mother, entire family and surrounding. From a typical middle class family, that too from a small town of Bihar, I always had a pressure to perform well in my academics. I was fortunate to have a good family background. Unlike many, we had enough paternal wealth to survive well in middle class life. But those days, after 10th, we had only three choices for further studies. Either we had to opt for biology in our 10 plus 2 to pursue a medical profession and become doctor or opt for mathematics to become an engineer. If not these two, then have to prepare for government jobs, entrance test, be it for Clark grade job or for civil services, no other option. I was lucky enough to spend my childhood in three major cities in Bihar. Goda, Devgarh and Patna was few of them. All of these cities were having an excellent academic atmosphere. Due to family pressure or you can say old tradition, I had to take biology as a subject in 10 plus 2, keeping medical profession in my mind. I had hostel life in Patna and Devgarh and have gone through almost all the phases of life. Sometimes we had no money to eat. Those days we depended upon money orders, not on excellent banking systems. Sometimes we needed to find time to study due to our own large circle. It was fun time but taught us a lot. I was preparing for medical entrance test. But at that time too, I wanted the best college for me and failed to get it in two attempts. Then after graduation, I decided to break the old tradition and chose management study as my next career option. Those days, it was a very bold decision. Nobody was expecting this career move from me. But I had decided and my parents supported me. I had chosen IES Management College for my PG degree in Business Administration as a marketing major and came to Mumbai. Mumbai, the city of dreams, the city of glamour, the city of passion and professionals. This city will teach you lessons of life. Once become a Mumbaiker, you always remain a Mumbaiker. You need to adapt and understand this city. After spending 12 years mixed academic and professional life in Mumbai, I went to Delhi and Bangalore for next professional assignment. Personally, I always believe in breaking the old path and taking new challenges. So I ventured into startup Aura and started two new ventures. During the establishment of these two ventures, I needed performance oriented professionals to help build and run my enterprise. During my conversation with them, I found many of them come from very ordinary backgrounds. 
they constitute almost 80% of MBAs from the country, a much larger audience. I needed to tell why they should believe they can become high performance individuals. There are several reasons I chose to write this book to explain my understanding of current professionals, the training process, the gap between their academics and the real world, the dilemma of their institute's grade and later on their workplace, specific grade for appraisal. There is a big gap of skill sets and quantity of management colleges versus quality and quantity of pass out MBAs. I don't want to blame our infrastructure or education system, but I will try to find out the way. This edition of book narrates the areas of MBA person's life coming from a moderate background to become successful. What theoretically they need to do or need to know, but all you need to know you already have within. When people come from small town and a simple upbringing, they often deeply discount themselves for their inability to relate to uncertainties of a professional life in an alien environment. Contrary to popular belief, one does not become a successful professional or entrepreneur just by attending professional qualification or getting a good job in multinational. An MBA has a lot more to learn and understand. It is possible for anyone to make it in life. You don't need to be afraid of great system, ensure of acceptance in an corporate race, believe in yourself and learn straight from life as you live life every day. If I could make it, so can you. I am writing this book for the everyday needs of true professionals who want to lay the foundation for success from the lessons they learned straight from life. Rupesh Kumar, Delhi, India, 9th July 2017